we don't often give ourselves enough credit. We've been through a lot in life that many other people haven't. And to other people, a lot of the things that we've learned is very valuable. A lot of the skills that we've built up are very, very unique. For example, we might think in our small town or our country or whatever that what we do is normal. Maybe we think that being an athlete is normal, but in all reality, I came from a small town and being an athlete there is normal, but in a city where there's you know, 30,000 people in the school or whatever, not everybody makes a team. Only like 50 people make a team. So being an athlete there is extremely valuable. It's, it's extremely different. And uh, yeah, so in all reality, when looking at the, the whole population, being an athlete isn't actually that common. But to me, growing up in a small town where everybody's an athlete, it seems just normal that everybody would be an athlete. And this could be applied to anything, right? So like the English that we learned is actually very, very valuable. If you were to go to another country, you can get like a really good job just teaching English, even if you don't have a degree in English or a degree in anything. And that's because only 12% or something like that of the world actually speaks English, <laughs> which if you speak English as your first language, you probably think everybody speaks English, but no, that's not true. And so all these basic skills that we think are just like so common that everybody has are actually super uncommon. And it's more just the environment we're in doesn't promote it as like a, an uncommon skill. So for me, recently, I've been thinking a lot about all the different things that I, I know and have to contribute to the world, the, the different value that I can provide on YouTube or in like in courses or sales or you know different things that I can apply to make money because that's that's where my mind's at I want to make some money right I'm a young man and uh, anyway I've been thinking about how uh, I, I'm a very decorated athlete and that's actually pretty uncommon in the world if I were to go to another country and say yeah, I played four sports and all throughout high school and stuff and they're like wow I was barely I, I, all I've done was work for my family business because I didn't even go to school because we were broke or something like that would be a super valuable asset to them for them to learn about their health and to be able to take care of themselves in a way that uh, they weren't able to before that would be super super good for them um, or whatever my uh, my English is obviously one but like my travel experience a lot of people haven't traveled and traveling can be really scary there's a lot of unknowns there's a lot of things that you don't know especially traveling out of the country but even just going to the airport and like going to a different place flying like that can be scary so like that could be something i could com contribute to somebody i'm freezing man it's so cold <laughs> and windy today i got a uh a wind protector so you probably can't hear it but it is it is cold so um anyway there's all sorts of different things i can contribute i've learned uh spanish as a second language and I did that on my own time so I can teach people how to learn Spanish as a second language on their own time. And that's like super valuable. But for me, it's like, well, I already did it. And for some reason, it seems normal, even though nobody around here does that. It seems normal to me because I've, I've done it for so long. Um, or different things like that, you know, pursuing online business. A lot of people haven't done that. That's super unique. Anything that you've done that's like even, even remotely uh, valuable to you. Is probably valuable to somebody else no matter how common you think it is there's probably somebody in the world in some little pocket of area that actually could really benefit from it so uh, those are my thoughts right now uh, going around in my head is uh, the different the different skills that I have how can I use them to help other people because when you help other people when you provide value to the world usually you can be rewarded monetarily or in some other form you can be rewarded in relationships or whatever and so um for me i'm focused on money <laughs> i'm a young man what do you what do you want from me so uh yeah those are my thoughts think about the skills that you got like what is there that you can contribute to the world that maybe uh maybe you think is common but actually is pretty uncommon to somebody else uh yeah thanks for watching <laughs> peace out